It's time for school, stinky face. It's almost time for school, stinky face, said Mama as she packed my lunch. But I had a question. Mama, what if the school bus was already stuffed with too many kids and the second I stepped inside all the tires popped flat? If all the tires popped flat, I'd call the circus. I'd ask the clowns to come and drive you and the other kids to school in their crazy little cars. But Mama, what if I was so dizzy from the crazy clown car ride that I got lost at school and ended up in the principal's office instead of my classroom? If that happened, the principal would help you find your class. But what if she's really a witch at just pretending to be the principal? And she turned me in, uh, into a snarly werewolf in polka dot underwear and gave me a timeout for my super smelly breath. If the witch did that, I'd come and get you. I'd feed you raspberries while I sang Skip to My Lou and spun you around 47 times with a teacup on your head. That's the secret formula for breaking all nasty spells. I learned it in Girl Scouts. Then I'd help you find your classroom. But Mama, what if the glue had spilled at art time? Buckets and buckets of it and the door to my classroom had gotten stuck and no matter how hard I pushed I couldn't budge it. If you couldn't budge that door I'd get you the biggest bounciest pogo stick ever so you could go boing 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 right up to your classroom window and land inside. But mama what if I accidentally bounced right onto Miss Ritter's desk and made all her pencils fall and everybody laughed? Ooh, if you did that, you'd have to pick up all the pencils and tell Miss Ritter you were sorry. But Mama, what if Miss Ritter laughed herself silly and instead of teaching us our letters and numbers, she taught us how to make armpit noises and dance the hokey pokey? Hmm. If that happened, you would have an interesting day at school. But, Mama, what if it was my turn to feed the class fish, only when I went to the aquarium, the fish were all wearing its itsy sunglasses and drinking little milkshakes through teeny tiny straws? They wouldn't be very hungry if they were all filled up on milkshakes, but... Miss Ritter would probably give you another turn soon. And then, Mama, what if we were playing on the playground and an alien spaceship landed right next to the jungle jump? What if, if the aliens liked to play cat with mud pies, made a slimy green alien goop, and whenever you caught one, it would splat all over you and you were slimed? Hmm. If that happened, you would have a messy day. But a fun one, too, I bet. Mama, what if we walked in two straight lines back into our classroom, only when we got there, all the desks were flying around in the air? Hmm. If your desks were flying, I bet you'd all hop right onto them and have a zoomy game of desk tap. But, but Mama, what... What if it was circle time? Oh, well, if it was circle time, I'm sure all the desks would park themselves in their neat rows so that you could go get out of them and sit in your circle. But, Mama, what if it was story time, circle time? Only Miss Ritter forgot all her stories and she made me tell a story to the class instead. Hmm, you know what, my little stinky face? What, Mama? I think you'd do just fine.